Hi everyone. So I decided to do this video because as I was reading, I realized a lot of people didn't understand the whole barrel, sending barrels back home. So let me give you a little backstory on that. So basically, growing up in a Caribbean household, um, once you see this item, the barrel, once you see it, First things first, go collect all of your prized possessions and lock them up. Lock them away until that barrel is gone. Because if you don't, it's going to end up right in there. And six months later, you will see a picture of your little cousin down in the Caribbean playing soccer, wearing your customized Yankee t-shirt and Yankee hat. And when you ask your parents, what did they where did they get that from because that looks very familiar and their answer usually is well did the manufacturer that manufactured that yankee hat and yankee customized t-shirt made only one for you seriously they will that's exactly what they will say to you and then how about if you do notice that it's gone before it's even sent back home how about <laughs> they'll be like oh hey mom dad did you see my Customized Yankee t-shirt, customized Yankee hat. What are you asking me for? You always leaving your things all around the house. Go call your friend. You probably left it at your friend house. And you like a fool like calling your friend, yo, did I leave some my Yankee, customized Yankee t-shirt and Yankee hat over your house? And your friend like, no. I haven't seen you wore that in a minute. Like, okay. And then you're like, oh, okay, well, all right. Yep. Six months later, you'll find out what exactly happened to it. So that's the backstory with the barrels. And basically what goes in the barrel, the barrel basically holds everything. Soap, toothpaste, deodorant, um, clothes, um, food, like whatever could fit in that barrel, they will send it back home. Some of them send it to family, um, but in my family, they, it was really charity because my parents ran um, a charity in Haiti. So that's, where where that went but most caribbean families they it's usually going to their other family members so here yeah that's the best story behind that barrel thing i used to be traumatized by barrels girl all right <laughs>